Hey guys, welcome to the YouTube video. Today it's going to be a testing video. I have not done one of these in a while. And this is a bush that grows in front of my house all the time. And we do frequently have to cut it and trim it every now and then. But it doesn't have to be done much. All it needs is just a few wax and it's cut back down. Because as you can see, it's right in front of my kitchen window. So I have two swords to test out today. I have my falchion that I, bled, that I made out of a machete. And my pirate's cutlass. And I figured I would use these because normally what I do with this, I just take a simple machete and whack a couple of inches off of it. So I figured what better thing to use is the two swords I made out of machetes. First one I'm going to test out is this one. And if you hear the whining in the background, that is my dog. Sadly, she is inside. So anyway, let's go ahead and do it. Let's try it out. First, I'll take a whack right here. Wow. And I like the ring that it makes. Not bad. Not bad at all. Alright, let's see what else we can get real quick. Let's see if we can get right at the top. bad. Still sharp too. All right, now let's get the cutlass out. Next time I'll go around it. So I take another one right off the top right here. Not bad. Alright. Let's do one more test with the other sword. And then we'll call it a day. That should be just about doing it. Let's cut a little bit off the top right here. Oh, there we go. Alright, that's all we'll do. Not bad. Not bad for two swords. I, not bad for two swords that I made out of two machetes. Not bad. And I love the well balance of them. I mean, they're very well balanced. I can wield them both one handed. They're not overly heavy. And I can even toss them into the air and catch them. So I hope you guys enjoy the video. Let me know which sword is your favorite. Do you like the Cutlass better or the Falchion? So I hope you guys enjoy the video. And as always, stay sharp and keep collecting.